Have you ever been on a website where they have the word shipping, uh, refunds, and it says more information about me, and you click on this, and it takes you down that very same page to this area here. It's just easier uh, for navigating a website, and it really is helpful to somebody because uh, they can pinpoint items that they're really interested in. And we're now going to open up the file called the About Me Lesson. And I'm going to demonstrate for you exactly what this is. Now, this web page right here, it's an About Me page. Very important that you do an About Me page. You really will improve your sales by at least 20% if you have a really nice looking About Me page. Now, I'm going to, here's the first one I've done. This is our little menu Shipping, Insurance, Returns, My Stores, and Add to Favorites. So what we wanted was if somebody clicks on this, they go down to the anchor shipping. So let's just see how that works. I'm sure you're familiar with this. The moment you see this, you're going to say, oh yeah, I know what this is. I've done this a million times. All right, here we are on the page. We're in a live web browser. I click on the word shipping and it takes us right to the shipping area. Now we're going to, I'm going to show you exactly how to create that link. For some reason, it's just human nature that you start here and you want to put your anchor here. But you want to remember, we're going to do the word insurance, that the anchor to the boat is at the bottom. So let's take and put that anchor right there. You highlight the word, you go up to the little icon that looks like an anchor, and it says insert anchor, and we're going to call this insurance. I do it all in lowercase letters so I don't have to remember anything. How did I spell it? It has to be identical on the top of the page. Now we go back up to the top of the page and we highlight the, the top, which is sort of our boat in a way, and we're going to click on link because we want to link that word insurance to our anchor. Now this is a little HTML. You always put a pound sign in front of this and then you type in the word of the anchor where you want it to go. Then this boat knows which anchor to go to. All right, and there it is. So let's check it out. I'll do a file, save. And let's check it out in the web browser. All right, here we are in the web browser. Press on the word insurance, and it takes us right to the word insurance. And that's a very simple way that we make an anchor. Now, in the very next lesson, we're going to uh, do the one my store and add to favorites. How do you do those? Well, that's really pretty simple, too.